Uh, hold on, let, let me send this. Let me send this out in my head. What? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck was that? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a lot. It, 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 it's, that's what they do. They'd be like, oh, oh my god. <laughs> okay. Whoa. <clears throat> yeah, that's good. Next. You, you know what? I'm going to agree with the protagonist, though. Uh, Monica is the best girl so far. If we're talking looks. If I'm the main character, I'm Ugh. still choosing Sayori, obviously, because I have a connection to her. But like, Likewise. Monica is definitely the best girl so far. Natsuki lifts the foil off the tray to reveal a dozen white, fluffy cupcakes decorated to look like little cats. Look, she's so proud. Proud of That's her work. That's a baker right there. Yeah. Can we Whiskers see him? Whiskers are drawn with... A... <laughs> 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 Are you hungry? Are you hungry? <laughs> I mean, like, I had like a thousand, cal a few thousand calories, but I, I'm down to knock back a cupcake or two. You know, you know what? what I, I wouldn't mind a cup, actually. No, that's, that's going to make me sound like EDP. The whiskers are drawn with icing <laughs> and little pieces of chocolate to make ears. So cute. I had no idea you were so good at baking, Natsuki. <laughs> well, you know, just hurry and take one. Sayori grabs one first, then Monica, I follow. It's delicious. Sayori talks with her mouth full and has already managed to get icing on her face. I feel like this guy has like a contempt for Sayori. He doesn't think too highly of her, you know? I don't blame him. Maybe that's why he, if I was trying to... like, he, he's kind of mean to her. Right. Be honest, let's so be honest, cute. Lieutenant. What do you say, bro? Like, you, don't understand what it's, you don't understand what it's like to grow up around a female, bro. Like, let me tell you something. If, if my sister was like a childhood friend, I'd still feel the same exact way, you know what I'm saying? Just because I know her to like such an extent where it's like, imagine you just like, you know with them for so long, you go in their room, messy as shit, disgusting as fuck. You see them niggas like, do like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you see that nigga pick their boogers when you were kids and shit like that, you're like, Ugh, you know what I'm saying? You still got that kind of, got that sibling kind of vibe. <laughs> I mean, like I said, I have no sibling, the... so. Yeah. I don't know, I wanted to be with Sayori though. But this guy seems like I found a picture of the cupcakes, like guys. They look so cute. Wait, do they show them on there? Because I found somebody like that made them on real life. Wait, you looked it up? <laughs> yeah, they're so cute. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, well, we'll see if they show them in the game. Okay. I turned the cupcake around in my fingers, looking for the best angle to take a bite. That's oh, by the way, guys, 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 guys. What? I need to tell you something. The best way to eat a cupcake is that you get the cupcake, you rip the bottom <laughs> half of the of the no. cake No, 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 no. Don't listen like to him. Don't listen to him. That is the most that, no, it's yes. not. No, it's yes, not. It is no, it's not. Way. Next. Next. Keep playing. Next. Nah. Because then you're not <laughs> eating a cupcake. You're eating a sandwich. It's now, I feel like the proper way to eat a cupcake is this. Take off the top, put mm -mm. the bottom on the top, and eat it like a sandwich. Let's give it a try. It's an even That's distribution ridiculous. of the icing. <laughs> <and the cupcake. laughs> that is wrong. It is right. It tastes right. Isn't it weird, Santana? Uh, I just eat it normally. I don't know what to say, man. <laughs> I just... Yeah, you just eat it normally. Yeah, just eat it normally. I don't know. I can't help but notice her sneaking glare. Ooh, okay, <gasps> Abel. Okay. And you said, see, Abel, you said she had a flat chest. And she likes you, Abel. She does. Okay. Wait. Yeah. But notice her you said that? glances in my direction. Abel said that. That's rude. Mia, yeah, you laughed when he said it. I, I said that thing. You literally I did? No, it was in game. <laughs> I No, I don't I, remember this. Abel, it was not in game. It was not in game. No, it wasn't. You're lying. <laughs> it was in game. <laughs> you said that out of your was. own free will. The game didn't say that. <laughs> I don't remember that. And yeah, you laughed when he said that. What are you out of it? I, I did? I, I think I laughed at something else because I don't remember that. We'll, we'll see, we'll see. Hey, the video's dropping, we'll all see. <laughs> we'll all see. <laughs> okay, Natsuki has a little crush. You gonna pull a bell? Is she waiting no. for me to take a bite? I finally bite down. Oh, what no, if she's no, only no. seeing to see if she if he likes the cupcake? The icing is sweet and yeah. full of flavor. I wonder if she made it herself. Mm, it's really good. Thank you, Natsuki. Mm, why are you thanking me? It's not like I... Huh? Fucking tsundere. What? Haven't I heard this somewhere before? What is going on here? Made them for you or anything? Oh. Interesting. Oh, I thought you technically did. Sayori said. Well, maybe, but not for you. Wait, what? Oh, not for you know you, dummy. Dyslexic bitch. 
She apologized first, I apologize. What the fuck did I do? I, I don't know, but you're not you always call me dyslexic. <laughs> okay, but I'm not mad because you're calling me dyslexic, I'm mad because you called me a bitch. Ah, uh, is it the bitch part? Alright, I'll apologize for the bitch. Okay. I, I just apologize. I accept your apology. So, and, and, uh, and then you apologize. <laughs> no, why? Ah, uh, okay. Mm, you, mm, okay, you know what? I'm a little no fly because I'm a bitch. <laughs> I'm, I'm six five, feet I'm tall. Sorry. I don't, you know, so I, I can. Right? Yeah. The dyslexic part is not bad. Like, that's cool, right? Yeah. I, I wouldn't have I cared. Would have... I wouldn't have cared. But you do call a bell dyslexic all the time. Oh, I'm sorry if it offends you. I'm sorry if it offends oh, you. Now you make me. Now you make me. Oh, 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 oh. She knows I guess like me, nigga. <laughs> okay. All right. No, we chill, in, all right, we chill, 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 chill. Hey, we need to make rules. No infighting, no lore dropping, no. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Wait, what's infighting? Like this? Just arguing? Like, like fighting amongst yourselves. We're not fighting, we're arguing, man. Yeah, yeah, we're arguing. <laughs> like, no, he's, he's scared. He's because, like, uh, this be happening a lot, you know? Where people are tearing in, in each other in our other Griffin group. And he's like, yo, and we, he has to hold. He thinks he thinks he's holding the group together when it's actually me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're trolling! You're trolling! You're trolling! <laughs> it's actually me. You're trolling. You know what I'm saying? What was the other one? I, I, said? I pull that shit together like Spider-Man. No, um. I just said it, bro. No, no, Lord dropping. Oh, oh, oh no, yeah. no, Lord dropping. Uh, if, if you guys think of a third one, uh, feel free. I would ever. No, calling me a bitch. Yeah, that's no infighting. Okay. All right. All right. I give up on Natsuki's weird logic and dismiss the conversation. Yuri returns to the table, carrying tea. Carefully places a teacup in front of each of us before setting down the teacup, teapot next to the cupcake tray. You keep, a whole, you keep a whole tea set in your classroom? Don't worry, the teacher gave us permission. After all, doesn't a hot cup of tea help? What the fuck? After all, <laughs> doesn't a hot cup of tea help you enjoy a book? I'm not even gonna say anything. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey, Abel, okay. you see, she's uh -huh. listening to rule number one. You listen to. Mm, that's um, okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. 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 Most of the time, okay. Ah, <coughs> uh, uh, I guess. Okay. How do I say that? <laughs> Don't let yourself get intimidated. Yuri's just trying to impress you. Eh? That's not. Insulted, Yuri looks away. Does everybody have a crush on this guy? Why do they all want you? Yeah, that's that's yeah, not accurate. That is not accurate. I meant that, you know? I believe you. Well, tea and reading might not be a pastime for me, but I at least enjoy the tea. <laughs> I'm glad. Yuri faintly smiles to herself in relief. Why does... Okay, this guy must be like an attractive loser or something. Like, what's going on here? Monica... Oh, wait. Monica raises an eyebrow and smiles at me. Okay, Abel. Okay. Pulling all these high school girls. So, what made you consider the literature club? Uh, say the truth. Um, say there's a whole bunch of me. bad bitches, you know. Uh, <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I was afraid of this question. Something tells me I shouldn't tell Monica that I was practically dragged here by Sayori. Well, I haven't enjoyed any clubs yet, and Sayori really seemed to be happy here. So, that's okay. Don't be embarrassed. We'll make you feel right at home. Okay? As president of the literature club. It is my duty to make the club fun and exciting for everyone. Monica, I'm surprised. How come you decided to start your own club? Ooh. You could probably be a board member at any of these major clubs. Okay, Riz, 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 maybe. <laughs> Weren't you a leader of the debate club last year? <laughs> well, what you know, the fuck? to be honest, I can't stand all the politics around the major clubs. It feels like nothing but arguing about the budget and publicity and how to sh prepare for events. Oh man, maybe, maybe I'm just You're damn person. right. I'd much rather take something I personally enjoy and make something special out of it. That's nice. And if it encourages others to get into literature, then I'm fulfilling that dream. Monica really is a great leader. Yuri also nods in agreement. Then I'm surprised there aren't any more people in the club yet. It must <laughs> be hard to start a new club. You could put it that way. Not many people are very interested in putting out all the effort to start something new, especially when it's something that doesn't grab your attention, like literature. You have to work hard to convince people that you're both fun and worthwhile. 
but it makes school events like the festival that much more important. I'm confident that we can all really grow this club before we graduate. Right, everyone? Yeah. We'll do our best. You know it. <laughs> Everyone enthusiastically agrees. All right, now that they're all here, Abel. Okay. Uh, I know you're an EDP type of guy. Uh, which one are you choosing? Uh, which one am I choosing? I'm picking Yuri. Okay. Yuri. Interesting choice. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I like Yuri. Because okay. the one on the left is just, it's too much of like- Too little? Short, yeah. It's and overall, little. everything. Yeah. Yeah. Childhood, I'm go, I'm going I like the notion. You know what, not, I'm gonna change it. Uh, I'm gonna choose a Sayori. I do like Sayori. Okay. I don't like her, but like, I, you know, I feel it. You know, Are we doing like, like we only look together. twice? I mean, we don't really know them too well right now. I don't know. You, well, yeah, like either Yuri or um, Sayori. I'm going with Monica, through and through. Such different girls, all interested in the same goal. Whoa. Yeah, uh, I know. Well, that kind of sounded a little weird. Monica must have worked really hard just to find these three. Maybe that's why they were all so delighted by the idea of a new member joining. Well, I still don't really know if I can keep up with their level of enthusiasm about literature. So, Abel, what kind of things do you like to read? <laughs> well, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> He's literally talking to himself. <laughs> Subtitles. <laughs> Considering how little I've read these past few years, I don't really have a good way of answering that. <laughs> Manga. I mutter quietly to myself, half joking. Natsuki's head suddenly perks up. It looks like she wants to say something, but she keeps quiet. Not not much of a reader, I guess. Well, that can change. What am I saying? <laughs> I spoke wait, wait, why did I read it in the feminine voice? <laughs> yes! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I'm tired, bro. What the fuck is wrong with me, man? I spoke without thinking after seeing Yuri's sad smile. Anyway, what about you, Yuri? Romance, probably, I guess. Well, let's see. Yuri traces the rim of her teacup with her finger. Interesting observation. My favorites are usually novels that build deep, complex fantasy worlds. I was wrong. The level of creativity and craftsmanship behind them is amazing to me. Real. And telling a good story is such a foreign world is equally impressive. Yuri goes on, clearly passionate about her reading. Wow. She seemed so reserved and timid since the moment I walked in, but it's obvious by the way her eyes light up that she finds her comfort in the world of books, not people. That's nice. Same. I feel it, bro. I used to be like that with my other nigga, bro. Ah. Uh, but you know, I like a lot of things. Stories with deep psychological, stories with deep psychological elements usually immerse me as well. Isn't it amazing how a writer can so deliberately advantage of your own lack of imagination to completely throw you for a loop anyway okay. i've been reading a lot of horror lately i was completely wrong when i said romance <laughs> she likes fantasy and horror yeah i, I read a horror book once <laughs> once i desperately <laughs> grasp something i can relate to at the minimal level <laughs> you guys know that one like switch <laughs> what <laughs> she's about to roast me now guys Wait, wait, what are you no, 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 I'm not. You know that one, like, Spongebob clip that's like, I lost something once. <laughs> yeah. I've never watched Spongebob. Ah, uh, uh, you have no fucking life, bro. Oh, my phone. <laughs> no, never mind, that was my... I just thought it was funny, guys, sorry. I oh, my inhaler, I dropped it. I haven't it. watched uh, fucking Spongebob. <clears throat> At this rate, Yuri might as well be having a conversation with a rock. Isn't there three other girls there? Why is it only just them two talking? Oh, there we go. Really? I wouldn't have expected that, Yuri, for someone as gentle as you. I guess you could say that. Wait, so she's like spilling more tea now that this dude is here? Kind of crazy. Ah. Yeah, well, not tea in a sense, but like... But like more about herself, you know? Yeah, yeah, because they yeah. didn't know she liked horror books until yeah. now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Even though it's supposedly a club. Yeah, like funny. what else do you do? Okay. But if Abel's a story makes here. me... Mm. <laughs> I'm not a Rizzler. Rizzler? <laughs> oh my god. Uh, but if a story makes me think or take me to another world then i really can't put it down yeah, he's yapping in front of a bell here for real uh, give someone else a turn <laughs> he's the only guy there surreal horror is often very successful at changing the way you look at the world if only for a brief moment i hate horror i feel that first I, hater yeah she, she looks like she hates horror she looks, no, I, she looks she, dude speaking. dude because of you know what happened because i watched the uh because of that one what was that one this it was like the strain no the the mm -hmm. boogeyman 
Boogie, you remember that movie, The Boogeyman? I, that, oh, uh, is, is that, a, is that the yeah. one with the, hot, the actress? Yeah, yes, I think. Dude. Yeah, that, oh Her. my god, bro. Yeah, I watched that movie. Oh, oh my yeah, god. I watched the I movie kid you for not. a completely different reason. Dude, it, and I don't know, you, you weren't scared when you watched it, but I was watching it in a movie theater. Man, ah, dude, I turned into a woman so fast, bro. I got, oh, dude. It was so much. It was not PG-13. I wanted to watch a scary movie because I was on a date with a chick. And I was like, I saw this movie come out. I'm like, oh, shit, it's PG-13. Nigga, I'm a grown-ass man. I can handle that shit. Bro, dude, I was not prepared, <laughs> bro. I was not prepared. Like, I started tweaking out in real life. Like, we were at that diner, and uh, me and like, me and two other niggas were just chilling. Yeah. Dude, I, I saw this nigga. This nigga comes in, right? Uh -huh. Six foot 11, black man. <laughs> dude, no, he wearing was not. All <laughs> He I'm not, not joking. He was 11, dude. I, I kid you not. He was black, all wearing all black, dude. I, I when I looked around, I genuinely thought it was the boogeyman, and I was, <laughs> I was like, I was like, oh my god, how? I was like, there's light in because he can't. I was like, I was like, how is he here? How is he getting me? Wait, I thought there's light in the building. He can't be in here. There's light, and I was like, and I tweaked out so hard, I almost fell on my desk. And then I, then like when I like re locked in and I realized like it was an locked actual person. Locked in? <laughs> oh, yeah, dude, dude, dude. Cause I was like in, I was in fight or flight mode. Like I was ready to like to go down. I was like, I ain't gonna die like All a right. bitch. You know <laughs> okay. what I'm saying? I, I don't think you understand. I was panicking so much. <laughs> and then man, when I realized it was a normal person, dude, oh my god, the the amount of shame from being a pipsqueak and tweaking out like that <laughs> just overcame me, bro. Dude, like the Is other two about, niggas, about, they were beats because they saw me. I watched the yep. movie too, but I wasn't scared because I was just looking at her the whole time. I didn't even watch the movie. Dude, too I don't. You don't understand, man. Dude, oh, I don't want to remember it. You know, I couldn't sleep for the next three months without uh, about, my about, lights you're on. Black. How did so you bad. see a black man and get scared? Like, <laughs> come on. Okay, man. that's the most un a black man being scared of another black man. That's the most logical thing to be scared of. <laughs> you know who hunts? Okay. okay you okay, know, okay. it's the number one. You know, right, hey, 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 let's I'm gonna steal tell away you from this conversation. Joke. This this is, might not be YouTube friendly. Real quick, right, real quick question. What? What do black people and watermelon? Uh, is uh, number uh, one. Uh, okay. What is black people? Uh, what? What? Okay, What's black let's, people? Right, let's, let's watermelon. Let's 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 number one let's predator. Let's okay, end it here. Let's end it here. Let's end it here. That's enough. You guys like TV girl? Huh? TV girl? Yeah. yeah. TV girl? Yeah. Do you like them? I've never heard of them in my life. Oh. Right. Their music's Likewise. really good. I like Safe Word and The Blonde. Um, was, it at? was it at? Was it at? Was it at? Under, that, that album, the, the Pink and Blue album, is really good. Right, I'll play like you know I have a safe seconds. word with. No 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 <laughs> Wait, yeah, that's a good I, I idea. I remember that. I remember that. Yeah. King shift leader. It may, I, I, it's like, niggas got a problem with me hugging him. I'm like, bro, what? He's like, we're grown ass men. I'm like, nigga, so. Nigga. <laughs> it's like, I can't hug my niggas, bro. I am very glad I decided to not play uh, Literature Club Plus because apparently that adds like two hours of content to the game. And <laughs> I yeah. feel like we're not even 10% of the way through this game and we're already an hour in, so I'm very glad. Oh, we're I definitely not. Play. Yeah, I'm very yeah. glad we chose to play the regular version. Oh my God. This like we just learned the girls' names. <laughs> we, we just learned That's the main character's name. And we're an hour and 15 in. <laughs> Wait, but let's let's be for real though. Like thirty minutes of that is just fucking yapping. <laughs> yeah, I mean it's let's, the yaps that let's, that let's make them going. enjoy let's it. Keep going, okay. Uh, did you read this already, Abel? I think I don't did. think so. I think you oh? did. Fuck it. Why is that? <laughs> well, I just. Natsuki's eyes dart over me. Oh, over to me for a split second. Never mind. Oh my god. What are you trying to say? I'm ugly? Like, what do you mean? She's like, she talks <laughs> a whore and then looks at me. I'm like, what, what nigga? Are you trying to say I look like a gremlin? Oh. Uh -huh. That's right. You usually like to write about cute things, don't you, Natsuki? <laughs> what? Grown ass woman writing about quote cute things. Uh, what gives you that? You consider high school what girls grown ass women about? No, 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 no. Never mind. 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 <laughs> <laughs> it's good to know, though. It's good to know. No, 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 no. You oh, left a no. piece of scrapbook uh, behind that last club meeting. It looked like you were working on a poem called... Don't say it out loud and give that back. Fine, fine. 
<laughs> your cupcakes, your poems. What's going on here? They're picking on her. Oh no, they're not, but she's just self-aware of it. Self-conscious. <gasps> Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Bless you, Bo. <laughs> bless, bless you again? Oh, you know, okay. What's up? Next. I have you a good? question. Well, I just put my headphones on and I hear a fucking fat-ass sneeze. <laughs> you know what I don't like about people? What? When I sneeze, right? Because you know I'd be sneezing like three or four times. Oh, but it's always like the it's always like the three people. It's always like the third or the fourth sneeze. Niggas just look at you weird, you know. And I'm like, <laughs> nigga, I can't stop. And they'll be like, they'll look at me in contempt. Like, what do you want me to do? Not sneeze? I have to sneeze. <laughs> you know, look at like look at me like a thug. And I'm like, I right, bro, whatever, man. You know. I haven't been sick since uh, I think it's been a whole year actually. Anymore. Nah, bro. I'm not sick. I literally no, no, these but, are but, allergies. But bro. when I get sick, I like I I combust. I fucking die. Oh, you like the yeah. memes? Like when men get sick <laughs> and they're like actually dying. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Literally. Dude, I get I, sick I got like sick last year, and then before every that, month. I didn't get sick for like fucking since high school. But when I get sick, oh my god, I'm a I'm a dead man walk. I need vitamins because yeah. I be dying like yeah. hella hella often. Dude, I remember I was like a. Dude, I remember, like, when I was, like, young, like, I was a kid, like, I was, like, dying. I was, like, oh, I need help. And none of these niggas in my family gave a shit about me. <laughs> and then I remember from, like, then on, like, I didn't give a fuck about whenever I got sick, right? And then it was, like, and then, like, one time I got sick after that, and I was, like, I was burning up. I was, like, it was so bad. I was, like, ass naked on top of the dining <laughs> table because it was, like, I needed to cool down, and I couldn't. Like, my body was extremely hot. And so, like, they were just like, what the fuck is wrong with him? And I was just like, they came up to me. They said, are you good? I was like, yeah. I was like, I'm good. I was like, I don't give a fuck. I couldn't even walk for shit. And I was like, I'm like, I'm good while I'm dying. And then, like, they were like, let's check your temperature, right? Mm -hmm. You know, they checked my temperature. Guess what my temperature was? <laughs> what? 104. Really? I was at 104 point, like. Were you hallucinating? Whatever. I was tweaking out big time, bro. Like, nigga, I was blacking out. I was like. Nigga, I'd be like, hey, you know, it's like uh, those cutscenes from like uh, like in games, mm -hmm. like where like where they just you close, they close their eyes and they're a completely different place. Yeah. Nigga, that was happening to me. <laughs> like I would just be like, uh, uh, and I'd be like, I'd be somewhere like on the floor in like the hallway. I'd be like, nigga, how the fuck I get here? You know what I'm saying? Cause like, uh, bro, it's just like crazy shit, man. No, that, that means average true, guy dude. experience. Everything you do is just as cute as you are. That's nice, Sayori. Siddles? Sidles? Slides when up she behind Biden? Atsuki and puts her hands on her shoulders. <gasps> a Joe Biden moment? What the fuck? Might take a whiff as well. <laughs> I'm not cute. Natsu, you write your own poems? Eh? Well, I guess sometimes. Why do you care? She's so uh, defensive. I think that's impressive. Why don't you share one of them sometime? Mm, no. Natsuki averts her eyes. I feel like there's a big ass plot twist coming, okay? Because there's no way this guy is pulling all four of these girls. For real. Turns out they're all lesbian. Never mind. <laughs> <gasps> really? No. You wouldn't what? like them. Wait, why'd you sound so happy when you found out they're all lesbian? Are you a lesbian? Nick? No. You're like, oh my gosh, there's somebody, finally, some representation. Because that would. Uh, there's a chance of that. Four lesbians in a row? That's, like, impossible. Dude, you know how depressed I'd be if I found out my girlfriend turned into a lesbian? I feel like there'd be <laughs> something wrong with me. Okay. Like I be mean, like you hear stories like I didn't think dude, I didn't think those were real. I was talking with one of my coworkers, nigga. He was like, bro, like, yeah, I was like I was like, oh we were just talking I was like, what's the worst thing that ever happened? He was like, Ah, ah well when my fiance of five years uh, turned out to be a lesbian. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like yeah, he was like yeah, I was like, nigga, what? And then he was like, Yeah, we known each other since like high school uh we dated for like a good six years and then i got and proposed to her and then you know we were playing this whole thing and whatever but uh yeah it turns out she was a lesbian okay That's... i dude i dude i'm not joking bro i want to cry for this nigga that's the only time i ever felt like crying for a nigga, that dude, that nigga. yeah 10 years like more than 10 years he was with this chick I'm like, nigga, 10 years gone like that, bro. That made me so scared. What did that happen to me? Oh, man. I, I, I don't think so, happened. though. Yeah, I probably wouldn't even get a woman in the first place. Uh, not uh, what? not what? very confident writer yet. I, I don't want to keep talking, right? Because, like, I want to get through the game. But, like, that's crazy. <laughs> like, imagine, like, <laughs> like, I'm thinking about it as myself, right? Like, oh, I yeah. could, like I've known my sexuality since literally, like, first grade, right? 
Yeah. Like, I cannot imagine being with somebody seriously, right? They propose to me. I say yes. I say yes. And that whole say time yes. I was wondering if I was straight or not. Like, what? That does not make any mm -hmm. That blows my mind. That doesn't make any sense to me. You know what made me more mad? He kept blaming himself. He's like, I should have seen the signs. I was like, brother. Well, no, no. Uh, that's, I mean, a, that's a her thing. No, that is all her. She Like, if that was, was me, her. if that was me, like, questioning myself, that would be a me thing, you know? That's not up to the partner. Like, how do you yeah. not know? That doesn't make... Like, I understand not knowing when you're younger, but, like, like, 10 years together? They're, like, at least, like, late 20s? Like, how do you not know? That doesn't make any sense at all. Oh, you don't understand. This nigga was, like, 34? No, that's even they worse. They know each other. Even worse. Like, what? Yeah. 34 years old, don't know, don't know if you're straight or not. <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah, bro. It's crazy, it's crazy. Ah, uh, not very confident rider yet? I understand how Natsuki feels. Sharing the level of riding takes more than just confidence. The truest form of riding is riding for oneself. You must be willing to open up to your readers, exposing your vulnerabilities, and showing that even the deepest reaches of your heart. Do you have writing experience too, Yuri? No, he doesn't. Oh wait, my bad. I thought she meant Bell. Maybe if you share some of your work, you can set an example and help Natsuki feel comfortable enough to share hers. Mm. Yeah, you, you can tell she's like the ringleader, the way he, the way she talks. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, she bulls them around. <laughs> I guess if it's the same with, I guess it's the same for Yuri. Ah, uh, I want you to read everyone's poems. <laughs> we all sit in silence for a moment. I like Sayori. She's so like. Yeah, I like her too. Chill. I don't like how uh, Abel thinks of her. In game, yeah. though, not actual Abel. Okay, I have an idea. Everyone. Question mark, and what do you want me to do? <laughs> wow. Hmm? Hmm? <coughs> <coughs> uh, Nat Natsuki and Yuri look quizzically at Monica. Quizzically. It's a fire word. <laughs> Let's all go home and write a poem of our own. Then, next time we meet, we'll all share them with each other. <gasps> That way, everyone is even. Okay, is there any homework out here? <laughs> um. Dot, dot, dot. Yeah, let's do it! Yeah, I like Sayori. <laughs> Plus, now that we have a new member, I think it will help us all get a little more comfortable with each other and strengthen the bond of the club. I almost said blonde there. She is the group leader. Definitely. Isn't that right, Abel? <laughs> <laughs> Monica smiles warmly at me once again. Hold on. There's still one problem. Eh? What's that? Now that we're back to the original topic of me joining the club, I bluntly come forth with what's been on my mind the whole time. <laughs> I never said I would join oh. the club. Oh my god. It was, yeah, they're gonna uh, shoot you, bro. Yeah, they're gonna kill him. Oh. Sorry you may have convinced oh me god. to stop by, but I never made any decision. That's crazy. I still have other clubs to look at, and... um. Bro, are they limited to just one? I lose my train of thought. Abel, would you lose your train of thought if uh, all four of them looked at you? What the fuck? She's got pink eyes. Yeah. And purple, dude. That's crazy. Wait, no, I didn't say. I no, I didn't say yeah to that. No. Uh, Wait. Yeah. <laughs> Abel, yeah, you right. would lose your train of thought if they all looked at you. I mean, I'd be intimidated. You know, four people. <laughs> they might like beat me up. They look at those. Okay, you're not getting beat up by these ones. Yuri and Natsuki have unnatural, or the only ones with unnatural uh, colors. Yeah. All four hmm. girls stare back at me with dejected eyes. But, but. Oh, she's gonna cry. What the fuck? I'm sorry. I thought. Hmm. Abuse. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so funny. Oh my god. That was actually pretty funny. <laughs> she couldn't even finish it. She started laughing before she finished. <laughs> Dude, it's because I'm not kidding. <clears throat> when I see your name like that in my head. It says a deal, but then I have to like <laughs> make myself not say it out loud, you know? Sure, nigga. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> uh, you, you all. <laughs> I'm, I'm defenseless against these high school <laughs> girls. All right, Abel, I see you. How Where does I it say high school girls? But it's like this. Oh, okay. You can't. I see Abel. You can't clear your train of thought when uh, high school girls are staring at you. I see, I see. That is, okay. if writing poems is the price I need to pay in order to spend uh, every day with these beautiful girls. All right, Abel. Oh, it's an everyday club. Right. Okay. I've decided. <laughs> <laughs> I'll join the literature club. Oh, one by one. What the fuck? The girls' eyes light up. Yes, I'm so happy. Bro, this feels like, like, is this going to turn into, like, some porn game? Like... Is that the plot twist? You wish? 
No, I was. <laughs> no, nah, this I was is why Sayori is the best girl. And this guy, I'm mad. I'm mad at the main character for not picking her. Sayori wraps her arms around me, jumping up and down. Hey, you really did scare me for a moment. If you really just came for the cupcakes, I would be super pissed. Then that makes it official. Welcome to the literature club. Uh, thanks, I guess. Okay, everyone. I think with that, we can officially end today's meeting on a good note. Everyone, remember tonight's assignment. Write a poem to bring to the next meeting so we can all share. Monica looks over at me once more. Abel, I look forward to seeing how you express yourself. I hope we don't have to write the poem. <laughs> I, I, oh, okay. I'd be hella good at that, bro. Uh, Abel's a goddamn Rizzler here. She's goddamn laughing to herself. Uh, I, y yeah. What if he's not a loser, but like he thinks he's a loser, you know? Mm. Like he's Jacob so. or something. Can I really impress the class star Monica with my mediocre writing skills? I already feel the anxiety welling up inside me. Meanwhile, the girls continue to chit chat as Yuri and Natsuki clean up their food. Hey, Abel, since we're already here, do you want to walk home together? The cut, yeah, Sayori, best girl. So she's even walking you home. That's right. Sayori and I never walk home together anymore because she always stayed after school for clubs. Sure, might as well. Yay! Sayori, best girl. Not gonna lie, though. If we have to write a poem, I got a few in the chamber. In the chamber? <laughs> <laughs> With that, the two of us depart the club room and make our way home. The whole way, my mind wanders back and forth between the four what girls. What the fuck? This nigga's gonna rub it out when he get home. <laughs> Sayori, in my opinion, for the main character, the best girl. Although maybe not because mm -hmm. he, he thinks bad of her, so, you know. He Rub would treat her me. bad. Yeah, he treat her bad. Natsuki. Eh, meh. Yuri. And, Pretty. of course, Monica. Will Monica's really... such a white name. Yeah. Uh, will I really be happy spending every day after school in a literature club? Why not? Perhaps I'll have the chance to go closer to one of these girls. All right. I'll just need to make the most of my circumstances, and I'm sure good fortune will find me. And I guess that starts with writing a poem tonight. It's time to write a poem. Pick words you think your favorite club member will like. Something good might happen with whoever likes your poem the most. Okay. I bet. You want me to want me to pull out one of my poems? No, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Oh wait, never mind. Wait, where's um, where's Monica? She's she's too out of our league. Remember, remember. What? Um, I think she's too out of our league. Oh, she's too out of our league. Okay, okay, but not these uh... three. Let's do Sayori. <laughs> oh, oh, so okay, so let's choose a girl, and then we'll choose whichever word fits her the most. Is that what we're doing? Mm -hmm. I vote mm -hmm. Sayori. All right, about who do you nice. vote for? Okay. Right. Fuck it, let's do st Sayori. Okay, Sayori, Sayori, Sayori. This one stands out to me. Joy. Yeah. Joy. Oh shit, she jumped up. Mouse. Unrequited. Disown. What the fuck? <laughs> Hop. Mm, she's hopping around. They're all hopping around though. Oh. Uh, maybe. No, mouse reminds mouse? me of a uh, of Natsuki. Like a uh, twirl. Twirl maybe. I could yeah. A bell twirl. Sure, fuck it. Or together, I think. Oh, oh. she jumped. That's not good. Uh, promise. Summer, jumpy, rose. Oh, giggle, see. giggle. Giggle. No! What the fuck? <laughs> Dude, she's not a giggler. Um, Dude, that's too cute. We have to do something. I know. Trust me, trust me. I know. All right, go ahead. Okay, okay. Oh. Nightgown. Whoa. Yeah. Explode. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think like explode is probably Sayori. Wait, yeah, we should do that one. Explode? Okay, yeah. Oh, you have one in mind? Why would she explode? Oh my this god. Is this is random. This has to be random. Because Yuri's yeah. not exploding. Um, There's no way. Papa. <laughs> loud. 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 Okay, that one makes sense. Finally. Kiss. Friends. Oh. Nah, friends is not good. Actually, I kind of just want to click kiss and see who jumps. Okay. What if it's random? What if the jumping is just random? I feel like it might nah. be random. Nah, it's not. You don't think so? Hmm. Miss Vibrate. Uh... Vibrate? Vibrant. Oh, vibrant. Vibrant. Why would you say vibrate? I, vi I thought you said vibrate. <laughs> <laughs> vibrant. Yuri. What the? Damn. This has to be random, dude. Milk. Fireworks. Fireworks. That makes sense. Death. Infallible. Infallible. Okay. Memories. Memories. Memory. Mm -hmm. Memories. Memories. Or warm. Oh, oh cause he's the Sayori is the only one who. Oh yeah, yeah. Them. Oh, that makes sense. Okay. So some of them make sense, but I feel like some of them don't. Um. Laugh. 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 Live, laugh, love. Oh, okay, okay, good, good, good. Excitement. What, what if the jumping actually doesn't mean anything and we're just idiots? <laughs> <laughs> we're just debating this. Like uh, 
Oh, horror has to be Natsuki. No. Right? Wait, who was the... Yuri. Yuri. Yuri, Yuri, Yuri. Yuri. Horror is Yuri. Excitement is... I'm not... Is Sayori. It has to be. Yep, makes sense. Universe. Sparkle. Sparkle? After no, 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 that's kind of cute. Nibble. Fireflies. Oh, yeah, let's see on it. Uh, no, no. Hmm. Question, maybe? Wait, what does question mean? Games, 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 games. Games? Oh, rock. Uh, yep, adventure. Yeah, adventure. There you go. Extraordinary. <laughs> Happiness. Happiness. Ah, oh, yes, nice. Inferno. <laughs> No, say I'm um, loves her bed. Is that a spoiler? I don't think she said that. Oh, she oh she does, she gets late to class because uh, she's always in bed. Yeah, yeah good call, Bell. Good call. Wrath. Aura. Aura. Or Rainbow? Rainbow. Who got that aura? Uh, did you get? Oh, I wonder who got the aura. Click it. Fuck it. Yuri has aura apparently. What the fuck? She got she got aura. Damn. Yeah, I guess sticky. <laughs> I kind of want to click that just to see. Click <laughs> <she's like> sticky. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, it's probably her because she's a baker. Oh, okay. I hope that. Lust! Oh, marriage? Like lust to see who click that lust, is. Click, click. Oh! Yeah, I'm not surprised. <laughs> it's always the cool um, ones. Unrestrained. That oh. one. What about or childhood? childhood. Yeah. yeah, childhood. Yeah. That makes sense, okay. Last one. Make it count. Pleasure. pleasure. Not pleasure, spinning. Yeah, spinning, it's yeah. Spinning. No, we did click twirl and it was her that. Mm. Hmm. Not true. Or play. Jump, jump, jump. Oh, play, play, play. Play? Oh, no, play. Play mix. Yeah. Okay. Yes. I hope I hope the uh, <laughs> the jumpings actually meant something. Hi, Ginnabel. Glad to see you didn't run away on us. <laughs> nah, don't worry. This might be a little strange for me, but at least I keep my word. Well, I'm back at the literature club. I was the last to come in, so everyone else is already hanging out. Thank you for your promise, Abel. I hope it, this isn't too overwhelming for too um, I hope this isn't too overwhelming of a commitment for you. Making you dive headfirst into literature when you're not accustomed to it? Ooh. Oh, come on. Like, he deserves any slack. Sayori told me you didn't even want to join the clubs this year. Ooh, the truth is coming out, guys. It's fucking ratting me out, bro. Then last year, too. Ooh. I don't know if you plan to just come here and hang out or what. Ooh. Ooh. But if you don't take us seriously, then you won't see the end of it. Alright, so I'm gonna elaborate something real quick. So must you two properly aren't accustomed to this phrase, Sundare? That is what uh that one pink haired midget is talking is, you know, that's her character type. A Sundare is a female that is uh basically like likes you but then always bashes your fucking head in and annoys the fuck out of you. How do you spell that? You know what I'm saying? They give you T S U N D E R E. So you know what a Sundare is. No, I just know how to fucking spell it. Wait, actually, I should have let Abel spell it out, because if he's dyslexic, he wouldn't have known how. Uh, I know how to spell Sundore. I read manga. Like, nigga. Yeah, but it probably would have, like, reason. been hella slow for him. No, I was going to say T-S-U-R. <laughs> yeah, that's enough. 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 Natsuki, you certainly have a big mouth for someone who keeps a manga collection in the club room. Oh, they exposed their shit. That's crazy. They exposed their shit. Well, mm, mm, mm. Natsuki finds herself stuck oh. between saying manga and manga. Manga is literature. Damn right. Swiftly <laughs> defeated. I fight to my parents to this day. Natsuki plops <laughs> back into her seat. Dude, my parents used to beef me so hard when I used to read manga, bro. Dude, I, I assure you, the, uh, the Pokemon manga is I thank them. They're the ones that unfortunately led me into the, the into where I am now. Unfortunately. Don't worry, guys. Abel always gives it his best as long as he's having fun. That's nice. Nah, I play basketball with zero effort. <laughs> Damn, she knows you. Aw, <gasps> uh, wait. Ooh, oh. that's gonna make the other girl He helps jealous. me with busy work without me even asking. Ooh. Ooh. Like cooking, cleaning my room. Oh, shit. You're a bum. You're, you're hey, a bum. The other girls I are gonna to... get jealous if they know, you know, he's in her room and shit. Wait, so this guy's... Maybe they are good friends then, because if he's like shitting on her, but he does help her out and stuff. The, the shitting on her in the, early in the game though did sound really genuine though. Like he actually didn't think that highly. Yeah, that's true though. How dependable. <laughs> Sayori, that's because your room is so messy, it's distracting. <laughs> you almost did your house on fire once, like my nigga, I can't leave you alone. <laughs> is that shit. so? <laughs> oh, okay. You are really good friends. 
aren't you? That's not what they want to hear. Oh, oh okay. Uh, Outright I saying it. But how come? You and Abella can become good friends too. Oh um, my god. Sayori. Hmm? Dot, dot, dot. Fine, bro. Oh As my usual, god, man. As usual, Sayori seems oblivious to the weird situation. Oh, I said that weird. To the weird situation she just put me into. As usual. Okay, interesting. I don't I get it. I relate with Sayori with being like, like, because like, I'm saying like, oh, we can get close and whatever. And she's like, I was like, whoa, nigga, like, chill out, bro. Oh, oh, Yuri even brought you something today, you know? Wait, wait, Sayori. This guy better be the best looking loser in the entire yeah, world. Yeah, I need to see a picture of this dude because it's just not making sense. It's not adding up. And it's an arc. <laughs> we, we, uh, we have to stop saying like people from <laughs> the friend group's names because like nobody knows what we're talking about other than me and you. Nah, but I feel like they can like they can like uh, fill it in, you know? They'll like interject <laughs> it with like their friend. Oh, you okay. know, it's like we're talking sure. about our friend. It's like. Yes. And it's like one of their friends is like, uh, you know, like that kind of looks like an ogre, you know what I'm saying? They're <laughs> like, crazy. they can relate. <laughs> That's crazy. They, we, everyone has that one friend who's like, you know, and they go, if you just fixed up your like your whole entire like face, you could get a lot of females. <laughs> That's crazy, bro. <laughs> That's I'm rude. That's crazy. I'm just joking. He's no, about, I, about, he's, about, he's about. a decent looking guy. Mm -hmm. no, no lore drop. <laughs> no. I didn't even drop that much lore. I just. <laughs> Did you read this book? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, eh, me? Um, not really. Don't be shy. It's really nothing. What is it? Damn, can I get some lines in here, bro? For real. N <gasps> never mind. Say always made it sound like a big deal when it's really not. Uh, what do I do? Eh? I'm sorry, Yudi. I wasn't thinking. I guess that means it's up to me to rescue this situation. What the fuck? Hey, don't worry about it. First of all, I wasn't expecting anything in the first place. So any nice gesture from you is a pleasant surprise. It'll make me happy no matter what. Is that so? Yeah, I won't make a big deal out of it if you don't want it to be. Uh, all right. Well, here. Yuri reaches into her bag and pulls out a book. Oh, I, was, I hope it's a gun. A gun? <laughs> I didn't want you to feel left out. Because, you know, I like that American kind of thing, you know. <laughs> so I picked out a book that I thought you might enjoy. She's so thoughtful. Yeah. It's a short read. So I should keep So should keep your attention, <laughs> even if you don't usually read. She just kept him. She called him a monkey. <laughs> it's like I know you're a bit stupid, so this isn't your. <laughs> Here's a picture book. <laughs> <laughs> right, and we could, you know. Whoa! Oh, I, I, <laughs> I gotta see a picture of this guy. Okay, <laughs> I gotta see a picture of this guy. Why are they getting so shy around him? Yeah, this, this is. <laughs> How is this girl accidentally being so cute, dude? I, honestly, I kind of don't like that people told me that there was a plot twist in the game because now I'm just like I'm waiting for it, like you know, because like clearly something's off. Turns it tur tur turns out that I'm gonna spoil it. The MC is no, actually no. trans. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's not it. That can't be it. Okay. I hope that's not it, though, because that, that would be crazy. <laughs> no spoilers, bro. No spoilers. Even I know. I know. Thinks so, like despite me not reading much. Yuri, thank you. I'll definitely read this. I'm not gonna fucking read this. <laughs> <laughs> I enthusiastically take the book. Phew. Well, you can read it at your own pace. <laughs> you can read it at your own pace, ape. <laughs> Nigga. That's what it like. <laughs> Pretty much. You might, you might as well, you know? You're like, here you go. Yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna be mean. I look forward to hearing what you think. Now that everyone's settled in, I expected Monica to kick off uh, some scheduled activities for the club. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Sayori, oh wait, Sayori and Monica are having a cheery conversation in the corner. Yuri's face is already buried in a book. Can't help but notice her intense expression like she was waiting for this chance. Meanwhile, Natsuki is rummaging around in the closet. Man, it looks like no one wants to be bothered today. I slump down into the nearest desk. How am I supposed to occupy with myself with something, with something literature related by myself like this? This guy has ADHD. I guess I could always read some of the book Yuri gave me. I'm feeling a little too tired to read. <laughs> Nigga, well, how can you be tired? fall asleep right now. Don't fall asleep, you thug. Close my eyes and end up listening in on Sayori's conversation with Monica. We're probably going to be... Well, we're probably going to seem really lame compared to all the other clubs, though. Hmm. Well, we can't <laughs> give up. The festival is our chance to show everyone what literature is all about. The problem is that the idea of a literature club sounds too dense and intellectual. But it's not like that at all, you know? 
We just need a way of showing that to everyone. Honestly, just get a whole bunch of hentai and just give it to everyone. They'll probably join. <laughs> I mean, honestly, with like four girls leaving the club, like somebody's going to join. Something that speaks to their creative minds. Mm, that doesn't solve the problem, though. Eh? What do you mean? Even if we come up with the most fun thing ever, nobody will come in the first place if it's a literature event. So it's more important to figure out how to get people to show up in the first place, you know? Makes sense, makes sense. That's true. And after they've come, we can do the thing to speak to their creative minds. What's this? Sayori being smart? Sayori is taking this really seriously. <laughs> Duh, she's vice president. It's rare to hear her deliberating like this. Huh, that's a good point. In that case, do you think food will do the trick? <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah. I mean, dude, if I, if I was a high schooler, I, go, I don't give a fuck. I'd join I, I, anywhere. I remember you in high school, though. <laughs> you were a thug. Nah, they call me the food bandit. <laughs> food bandit. It's not even a lie. That's not even a lie. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. I was, dude, I was iconic. I was, like, I was known for being able to steal any food that was, like, in a secured place. Yeah. Like, there was this one time, there was this, like, massive, like, dinner that was in the teacher's, like, thing. It should have like three locks on that bitch. No, I ain't gonna say much, but I'm gonna tell you this: there was no desserts in that fucking in that feast I, after I me, nigga. I remember when a bell <laughs> broke into the teacher's lounge. Uh, is this Lord dropping a bell? Do you want me to say this? Yeah, this, I don't give a fuck. This, this is, is really Lord dropping, but this is funny. That's why I want to say it. A bell broke into the teacher's lounge in high school when it was empty, and he walked out with like a whole tray of like just pastries, like bread and like. Like, oh my god! Shit, like, like a whole tray, literally a tray of bell. I have that. I have that image of you with a tray of bread ingrained in my head. Like, it's so ridiculous. Then, you know what's so funny? They actually, uh, when they pulled me in the office, uh -huh. they started. They went. Up, they showed me the footage, and they were like, "And they, all you see is me breaking into that bitch, <laughs> getting inside, and me running out with a whole tray of desserts." And they were like, "Hey, they were like, you got caught on camera," and I just looked at it and I was like. There's a million black kids. You don't know about me or not. <laughs> and they were, you know what I'm saying? And they were like, literally, a teacher saw you face to face with a whole tray of fucking desserts. And I was like, hey, man, you do not know. I, like, I was like a fucking lawyer at that time. I was like, you do not know from what point to what point that I had that tray. It could have been somebody else that stolen it and given it to me. You don't know. I was standing on business. Yep. <laughs> and they changed a lot. Dude, I'm going to tell you, I worked my ass off. But then they did that gay, oh, no, pardon, not gay, but they did that ridiculous thing where they like, they did the ultimate lock system where I couldn't break in. Man, <laughs> That's I tried That's crazy. Hard. Work yeah. your ass off to steal? Yeah, I mean, you know, I, you know, you gotta understand, I'm black. I gotta develop my black skills, you know? I can be black and not know how to steal. <laughs> That's um, let's move on, let's move on, let's move on. Okay. So, Bana, every time that you switch over to the Discord chat thing, uh, and I see the minions, I feel like that they were us laughing. <laughs> no, we're like, we're them laughing. <laughs> the minions. <laughs> like, I see that one with the, I see that one with the two eyes, and I feel like that's you, because every time you switch, you start laughing. <laughs> and I'm like, <laughs> okay, okay, let's go. What kind? Oh, shit, wait, I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> I meant to press enter. <laughs> oh, I guess we could. Cupcakes? Oh, they're gonna get not swiggy to make them, right? Yeah. <laughs> nah. Thing. The only people you're gonna attract is oh, that niggas and EDP. <laughs> that Suki would love to do that. Ah, you're right. Natsuki makes makes the best cupcakes. That works out perfectly. Wait, <laughs> that wasn't why you suggested it? <laughs> Cupcakes speak to my creative tummy. She's just hungry. Dude, if we're talking in terms of a best for the main character, uh, Sayori's the best girl, easily. Yeah. Easily. Yeah. Personality-wise. Cupcakes it is, then. I'm hungry. Hot ass. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we still need to work out the details of the event itself. I find myself smiling. In the end, Sayori is still her usual self. That's interesting. But therein... Uh, how do you say that word? Therein. That's how I always say it in my mind. Like that? Yeah. Therein lies. Like literally, just therein? Like, therein? Therein? Yeah. But therein <laughs> lies... Therein. The unexpected reason I admire her. Okay, okay. Unlike me, who has trouble finding any motivation at all, 
Sayori can put her mind to things and make them come to life. I suppose that's why I ended up letting her get on my case about things. I can't help but wonder what it would be like to see the world through her eyes. Mm -hmm. Why is she so... She's really, yeah, she's really close to the main character here. <laughs> I opened my eyes to find Sayori's face filling my vision. She's all up in his face. I nearly fall out of my chair. Sorry. Wait. Actually, I'm not sorry at all. It's your fault for falling asleep like that. <laughs> well, just you know, he was thinking of her. This isn't the napping club. That'd be a good club I'd join. <laughs> Does our school have a napping club? Dude, that, that's so dumb for a club. Like, what's the point of having a club to sleep in when you could just go home earlier instead of staying after to sleep? You could just go home earlier nah, and sleep in your bed yeah, instead of, like, nah, it would desk. Be... Graduation court. Nah, school, nah, school, no, no, nah, school was always the best place to take a nap. I don't know why, but it was like, when you in that chair and then you knock the fuck out, like, <laughs> I don't know, it just felt, felt more comfortable than my bed sometimes. <laughs> nah, dude, nothing can beat the bed, man. Nothing can beat the bed. You're staying up late again, aren't you? See, she's worrying about him. Yeah. Now that you're in a club, you're gonna have less time for anime, you know? Oh. <laughs> oh, no, oh my god, no big <laughs> deal. You'll need to get used to it. She's roasting his shit. Don't, say <laughs> Don't be so loud. <laughs> she's exposing his ass, bro. I glance. Aww. <laughs> he likes Monica the best. Blech. I glance over my shoulder to see if Monica overheard. It's true, though. This guy has Sayori right there, bro. Yeah, I know, I know. You're always looking out for me, Sayori. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I do best. Nigga, my inhaler fucking ran out of energy. Wait, about, you mean your vape? Yeah, I don't want to say vape, because it's sad. <laughs> but, uh, honestly, I don't That's people, crazy. Like, would you rather people think you have asthma, though? Like, <laughs> <laughs> you know, like... Because I know you don't have asthma. And when you said, you said inhaler, I was like, huh? Did this guy have a medical condition I haven't heard of? Because <laughs> I know you don't have asthma, so I was, I was confused there for a yeah, second. Man. This vape giving me asthma shit. <laughs> you, know. what? you look out for me better than you look out for yourself. You're still oversleeping every day, aren't you? Oh, oversleeping days are the best, man. <laughs> eh? Nah. I love oversleeping, man. Uh, not every day. That's very convincing. <laughs> How many days this past week have you gotten up on time? Ooh. That's... It's a secret. Exposing her shit. And it. Come on. At least give me the benefit of the doubt. Oh, shit. Can't even do that. Look, Sayori. It's written all over your face. Huh? Sayori glances around at herself. <laughs> How is it written all over me? It's a... It's a, it's a fucking manner where, of speaking. Where, where's it's her dunce cap at? You were clearly in a rush this morning. Oh, he's gonna make Look, himself conscious. Uh -huh. Your hair is sticking out all around here. Ah. Uh. Ooh, okay. I run my fingertips down the side of Sayori's hair, trying to straighten it out. Let's hope the other girls aren't looking. Man, <laughs> you're gonna brush this. My hair is just really hard to get right. I won't fall for that. <laughs> There's more than just hair. Oh, shit. There's more than just your hair. Fucking piece of oh, gum. Shit. Oh, shit. Oh. your bow. It isn't even straight. Uh, yeah, that doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> and there's toothpaste stain on your collar right there. Dude, why is it roasting her shit? I try to wipe off the stain with my finger. But nobody would ever notice that. Of course they would. <gasps> He's rude, man. Nobody's gonna oh. tell you about it because they don't want to embarrass you. Yeah. Fortunately, I don't care about that. <gasps> That's rude. Hey, you meanie. I, I could see this dialogue being both like flir flirtatious and mean, you know? Yeah. It, it could go either yeah. way. Like, it, I can't really tell. I need facial expressions here. And you don't even keep your blazer buttoned up. Seriously, Sayori. Why do you <gasps> think... Why do you... What? Why do you think you don't have a boyfriend yet? Is he, like, saying all this to, like, show the other girls that a... he doesn't count Sayori as an option, maybe? You know what I mean? That Not is really. so mean. He doesn't... He, he, he ain't big brain like that. That nigga's just saying it just to say it. You know what I'm saying? He, he just saying what's on his mind. Huh? That's super mean. <laughs> Sorry. But thank me later. I start to button her blazer from the bottom. Uh, Once you see how much better you it looks, you'll change your mind. Ooh. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> why is your foot tilted wait, like wait, that? Yeah, I was gonna say the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. A bell's white, apparently. <laughs> Shit, damn! I don't is got that, sweat. Is that sweat? Yeah, man. It's a ner it's a nervous sweat. You know what I'm saying? Cause you got. Me all up in your business fixing up your shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm the Giga Chad. Yeah, she even got the tilted feet. This is so funny. 
What is it? Well, I was just thinking how weird it is to have a friend who does these kinds of things. Yeah? Don't say that. <laughs> you make me feel weird about that, stupid. It's okay, though. How long did he say he and her had been friends for in the beginning? Since childhood. Since childhood. Okay. Maybe he does see her as a sister. I'm happy we're like this. Aren't you? Uh, I guess. Hey, be careful. The button might come off. Why is this one so hard to close? Because of her titties, man. I see. Yeah, it's fucking tighter up there. I struggle to fully close the button near her chest. Does this thing even fit you properly? Damn. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it did when I bought it. <sighs> if you ever button it, if you ever button it, you would have noticed sooner that it doesn't fit you anymore. What are you smiling about? Oh, is she smiling because her boobs grew? Is that why she's smiling? <laughs> well, I'm sorry, no, man. It's a horny high school or shit. It means my boobs got bigger again. Oh, my God. I didn't even, she even said that shit. I didn't even. Don't, don't say that out loud, bro. Like... <laughs> anyway, you look much better now, so. Uh... Why does it feel strange to see Sayori's blazer buttoned up like that? But it's so stuffy. Ooh. It's not worth it at all. <laughs> she has no space. Sayori hastily unbuttons her blazer once more. Phew. That's so much better. Sayori puts her arms around and twirls. So if I keep it unbuttoned, then I won't get a boyfriend, right? What kind of logic is that? And anyway, and why are you saying that like it's a good thing? Because... If I had a boyfriend, then he wouldn't then he wouldn't even let you do things like this. Hmm. I mean, she is right. Like, now would you be? I'll, I'll just be honest, right? Mm -hmm. No, 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 not even that. I'd be down. Like, I wouldn't care too much if my if my girlfriend had a childhood friend. I wouldn't care too much. But I could see how niggas can look at a nigga sideways if his girlfriend had a male childhood friend. You know what I'm saying? Especially if that nigga's like six eight, and like six eight. You know, like six eight. I like. Muscle bill, everything, like, you know what I'm saying? You got, like, oh, but, tattoos. But, mm, this character oh, ain't all that right. Yeah, that, that's what we're We don't we, even know. We don't got, know. Like, based off of what we yeah. see, this guy's a fucking... Oh. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I guess, yeah. I don't know. Are, I don't think so, though. They look, at this, mm, uh, they look at that nigga, and they're like, oh, shit, damn. Whoa. Damn. And you take care of me better than anyone else would, anyway. So that's why I'm keeping it unbuttoned. <laughs> Stop saying all these embarrassing things, man. Huh? I didn't say anything embarrassing. Jeez. Well, anyway, just focus on trying to wake up a little earlier, okay? Only if you focus on going to bed earlier. Fine, fine. It's a deal. <laughs> I guess we really are better at taking care of each other than we are at taking care of ourselves. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Huh. So maybe you should come wake me up in the morning. You're doing it again, Sayori. Ah, uh, but I was joking that time. Man, it's impossible to tell with you sometimes. Okay, everyone. Huh? Monica suddenly calls out. Why don't we show the poems you wrote now? Yay! Abel, I can't wait to read yours. Oh, and we wrote it for her. She had the most thugs uh, mm -hmm. out of all the, all the girls. Yeah, same. I failed to sound enthusiastic, but Sayori still trots away to retrieve her poem. I don't understand this relationship between him and Sayori. By the way, did you remember to write a poem last night? Yeah. My relaxation ends. Can't believe I agreed to do something so embarrassing. I couldn't really find much inspiration since I've never really done this before. Well, now that everyone's ready, why don't you find someone to share with? I can't wait. Sayori and Monica enthusiastically pull out their poems. Sayori's is on a wrinkled sheet of loose leaf torn from a spiral notebook. That fits her. That honestly that, fits her. That works, Oh yeah. my god. <laughs> <laughs> On the other hand, mm -hmm. Monica wrote hers in a composition notebook. I can already see Monica's pristine handwriting from where I sit. No! Actually, fuck this guy. Yeah, don't get with Sayori. Sayori's too good for him. Yeah. For real. Yeah. Natsuki and Yuri reluctantly comply as well, reaching into their bags. I do the same myself. Are we going to show it to everybody? Probably. I feel like we should do... Sayori. Okay. Who? Sayori. Sayori first, okay. I was gonna say we should go last. Yeah, I was gonna say like a... 
least important to most important. So like yeah. Natsuki, uh, yeah. Yuri, Monica, Sayori. Let's do Natsuki. 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 Yeah. I told Natsuki I was interested in her poems yesterday. What if I made a mistake? It's probably only fair if I shared mine with her first. Mm. <laughs> well, it's about what I expected from someone like you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? That's a little blunt. Well, excuse me. It's not like I said it was bad. It just didn't evoke any emotions. So basically, it's not cute enough for your taste. Do you want to get smacked? <laughs> Nigga, can you even reach? <laughs> can she even I'll reach? <laughs> She's tiny. Ah. Uh, well, anyway, I guess I need to show you mine. Not that you'll like it. Uh, Eagles. So do I read this? E oh, okay. Oh, well, you, want, you want to read it? Right. Oh, oh, everybody reads their own respective uh, persons? Oh, right. should we? I guess, sure. Fuck it, yeah. Okay. Eagles can fly. Monkeys can climb. Crickets can leap. Horses can race. Owls can seek, cheetahs can run, eagles can fly, people can try, but that's about it. Wow, pretty basic, but pretty good. I don't like this one, guys. I'm not really, really a poem guy, so I don't have a lot of, uh, you know, say, but uh, I will say this is uh, pretty trash. <laughs> Based <laughs> off of the very little I know. I, <laughs> like, this this is is a, I this get is what she's trying to say, but like, no, you know? Yeah. Oh, I, I'm sorry, this is being rude. I, I personally, my taste doesn't align with with this. <laughs> yeah, I told you that you weren't gonna like it. <laughs> I like it. What? Just be honest. I am. Why are you so convinced that I wouldn't like it? Well, because everyone in high school thinks that writing has to be all sophisticated and stuff. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sounds like you two, nigga. Oh my bad. So people don't even take my writing seriously. But isn't the point of poems? For other people to express themselves? Damn, you're right. I feel bad. Yeah. Your writing style wouldn't make... Your, your writing style wouldn't make your message any less valid. Yes, exactly. Okay. I like when it's easy to read, but it hits you hard. Like this poem. Seeing everyone around you do great things can be really disheartening. So I decided to write about it. Yeah, I understand. But the other nice thing about simple writing is that it puts more weight on the wordplay. Like... I set up for a rhyme at the end, but then made it all, f made, but made it, <laughs> but then made it fall flat on purpose. It helps bring out the feeling in the last line. Exactly. Yeah, you guys know all about poems, huh? <laughs> so you did. I guess. Oh, sorry, I just took a coke. I guess there's more. I guess more went into that than I realized. That's what it means to be a pro. <laughs> all right, bro. I'm glad you learned something. <laughs> Didn't expect that from the youngest one here, did you? Oh, you, she is the youngest one. Oh, is that why yeah. she's smaller? Not, it's not just because she's small? No, she's also small, nigga. Like, some niggas stay midgets, unfortunately. <laughs> like a very good friend of ours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess not. <laughs> good one of those. I decided to humor her with that last comment. I don't really care. I don't really care how old everyone is, but if Natsuki is feeling proud, then I won't take that away from her. Yuri. Uh, yep. Fuck. Oh, it's just a bell talking this whole time. Oh shit. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. We're gonna last an hour here. Uh... Fuck you. I got this. <laughs> oh, <I'm gonna> <laughs> uh... <laughs> oh, never mind. Here I am. I'm talking. Yuri <laughs> stares at the poem. A minute passes, more than enough time for her to finish reading. Um. Oh. Sorry. I, I, for I forgot to start speaking. <laughs> um. It's fine. Don't force yourself. I'm not. I just need to put my thoughts into words. Hold on. This is your first time writing a poem, right? Ah, uh, nigga. <laughs> er, yeah. What a bell. Oh, no, she's, she she read his said, poem. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. No wonder. She about to be like it. Nigga, this shit's ass, bro. <laughs> what is this dog shit I'm reading? Why do you ask? I'm just making sure. I guess that it might be after reading... It might be after reading, though. That's crazy. So you fucking suck. Ah, so it's bad. N no. Did I Dude. lose my voice? <laughs> I bet you get some guess who she's fuck? reminding me of. Who, who's he? Who's she reminding you of? Oh, I remember. Uh, hey. That Jenny, or, or that one girl, Jenny? the suicide girl. Julia. 
Suicide girl? Julia. She, yeah. She reminds me a lot of her. I'm sorry. Yuri buries her face in her hands. I couldn't help but notice that it's been several minutes and we really haven't gotten anywhere. It might take Yuri a while to get used to new people. It's fine. I really didn't notice. What were you saying? Right. Um, it's just that there are specific writing habits that usually tip that are usually typical for on ah fuck me. It's just that there's specific <laughs> writing habits that are usually typical of new writers. And having been through that myself, I kind of learned to pick up on them. I think the most notable thing I recognize in new writers is that they try to make their style very deliberate. In other words, they tend to pick a writing style separate from the topic matter, and they form and they form fit the two together. The end result is that both the style and the expressive are weakened. Once Yuri finds her train of thought, it's as if her demeanor totally changes. Her stammering is completely gone, and she sounds like an expert. That's nice. Of course, that's not something that you can be blamed for. There are so many different skills and techniques that go into writing, even a simple poem. Not just finding them and building them, but getting them to work together is probably the most challenging part. It might take you some time, but it all comes with practice and learning by example and trying new things. I also hope that everyone else in the club gives you valuable feedback. Natsuki <laughs> can be a little bit biased though. Biased? How? Um. Wait, huh? <laughs> well, Dude. never mind. <laughs> Everybody just likes exposing each other here, man. Yeah. I shouldn't be talking about other people like that. Ooh. That's crazy. Sorry. It's fine. I'm not sure. Yeah, me neither. I'm not sure if Yuri's apologizing to herself, to me, or to Natsuki. Do you mind if I read your poem now? Please do. I'd love to share my thought process behind it. Yuri Damn, smiles so dreamily much. as if it's a rare, as if that's a rare opportunity for her, which itself is kind of funny. After all, isn't this supposed to be a literature club? <laughs> you can tell the Ghost difference under the lo- oh, oh my god, nigga. <laughs> cursive? <laughs> I'm terrible at reading cursive. I got this. It's been a while. Ghost under the light. The tendrils of my hair illuminate beneath the amber glow. Bathing. It must be this one. The last remaining street light to have withstood the test of time. The last yet to be replaced by the sickening blue-green hue of the future. I bathe, calm, breathing air of the present, but living in the past. The light flickers. I flicker back. Okay. <laughs> I like this one. Yeah, this one's better. Yeah. I, I don't want to talk just because I need to be in, like, her head right now, you know? Like, oh. I'm just stressing out making sure I don't <laughs> fuck up to <laughs> reading. I, I I would be normal again, but like I, relax, I got the stutter relax, away. Relax, 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 relax. I'm just not breathe, relaxing. I'm just breathe, just breathe. It's okay. Chill. I like the problem though. It's really nice. I, I'm sorry. I have such terrible handwriting. What? I wasn't thinking about that at all. But it took you a long time to read it. Uh, nigga, I can't read hand. I can't read cursive. <laughs> uh, well. I just don't read script very often. I think your handwriting is very pretty. Eh? That's a relief. Also, I liked your poem. Even though it's short, it's really descriptive. It wasn't too short? I usually write longer poems. Thank God you didn't write a longer poem, nigga. <laughs> I would have probably fumbled. <laughs> Not at all. I'm really glad you liked it. I'll be honest. Since this is our first time sharing, I wanted to write something a little more mild. Sometime, something easy to digest, I suppose. Are you into ghosts, Yuri? Hoo-hoo. <laughs> Actually, the story isn't about a ghost at all, Abel. <laughs> monkey, huh? Hey, monkey boy, you thought, you thought it was about ghosts, eh, monkey? No. <laughs> Time to get educated, nigger. Like, just pretty much. <laughs> She thinks he's an ape, bro. <laughs> I might as well just be at a zoo at this point, bro. Like... <laughs> oh, he's an really? actual monkey. <laughs> well, what is this supposed to mean, man? Dude, he's an like, ape, nigga. Bro. <laughs> I must have totally missed the point. <laughs> well, I suppose you oh, did over bro. it after all. He's an ape. 
But remember that poets often express their own thoughts, feelings, and experiences in their work. They usually do more than tell a simple story, or a painting, a picture. In this case, perhaps the subject of the poem is only being symbolically compared to a ghost. Lingering in her past, uh, oh, lingering in her remaining place of comfort, unable to let go of the past, and soon to be left with nothing. That's a, a lot more solemn putting it in that way. I hadn't even thought about that. Shit, I'm a gorilla. Yeah, the main character is an actual, like, just straight balloon. No, I'm talking about myself. Like, I actually didn't think about that. I... No, 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 but, 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 uh, I, I give you a pass because you were focused on not stuttering. So, you know, interpreting that's wasn't impressive. really. I mean, uh, <clears throat> that's impressive. Yeah. It's nothing, really. Well, it makes me happy that you think that. Just, just remember that it won't take, it won't be long after. Oh fuck! I need to focus now. <laughs> just remember that it won't be long before you pick up on these things too. Yeah, maybe you're right. I guess I have to keep trying. I'm counting on you. Okay, guys. Now we do think, Monica. I think we should save these for oh. our next session. Okay. All right. Getting a little uh. late, but next session we're gonna start off with some gold here. Monica okay. Let's we'll see how that yeah. is. Uh, last, uh, last, last, uh, comments or whatever. Actually, I have one. Where's the, when's the plot twist coming? Like, <laughs> cause yeah. I know for a fact this game is, like, supposedly not as it seems, you know? And I still haven't seen that yet. Yeah, you will. Uh, like, I'm really wondering what it's gonna be. Well, I think it might have to do with, like, how the girls are with each other. Like, mm -hmm. I don't know. I mean, it's four girls. They all want, they all, like, have a crush on the same dude. Wait, Abel, is this game actually scary? Or is it just, like... No, nah, I've been fucking with you this whole time. So it's not. <sighs> okay. I feel like it might be a. Nigga, do you not understand sarcasm? No, I don't. I I'm I actually. Or those oh. who are easily disturbed. <laughs> like, it, like literally, it says that easily disturbed. And like. All right, we'll figure yeah. it out. We'll figure out the. Hey, hey, nobody. I know Abel. I'm pretty sure you already know, but like Nia, uh, don't look up like the spoilers or anything. Like just. Okay. Yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out as it comes, all right? We'll see. Okay. We'll see.